DM Consulting presents the docking of the APL-65 barrack ship at the San Diego Naval Graving Dock. The APL-65 is a very easy ship to dock. It has no propeller, it is a completely flat bottom vessel, and it has very little draft. One difficulty for docking is the massive sail area that can complicate positioning, although the flat bottom allows for an extremely large amount of air as the ship will always land flat. The blocking arrangement was simple. The side blocks were flat and level with the keel. Two blocking positions were chosen so the ship could be completely painted. The set of blocks in the first position would have sand caps that would initially support the ship. The ship would be painted entirely except for in these supporting areas. Once the paint is dry, caps would be inserted in the second blocking position and then wedged to support the ship. The sand caps are then broken and the sand is taken out, relieving the pressure and allowing the caps to be removed. This uncovers the initial supporting areas which can now be painted. The dock was pre-flooded to 20 feet a day before the docking, checking pumping and flooding operations, looking for debris and that the caps were secured properly, and anything that can help speed up a long day of docking. On the day of the docking, many things happen all at once. As the APL-65 is transported to the dock, the caisson is floated and moved to the side. Lines are used with the assistance of a tug to bring the ship in. Stabilizing the ship with lines while bringing her in can be difficult with a sail area as big as this one and a crew that is inexperienced or just new working together. Once the ship is roughly in position, the tug casts off, the caisson is replaced, and the centering chains are pulled into place. The final positioning takes place as the dock is pumped dry. Notice as night turns to day, as the pumping of this big graving dock is not a quick process.